Leslie started the gallery, she, it was so much of her vision, so much of her hard work. I remember she used to drive in from West Bay every morning, leaving there like 5.36 to get in. And um, when I came on board, there were only three people there, and I became the fourth. And um, in those days, it was Anne Goulden, who's been the longest standing um, member of the National Gallery, the staff member, and Ray Banker was there as well, and Leslie, of course. And I became her assistant director. She needed help at that stage. And then when she um, left to relocate to France, I became the director. And um, I think I was with the gallery for a total of just about nine years. I'm just overjoyed. I'm just so excited to finally see this come to fruition. It's been um, many years, many, many people involved in, in making this happen. It was super, super collaborative. I was the founding director of the National Gallery and uh, it's been a long journey and it's pretty amazing to be able to be in a place that's like um, having a dream come true because that's what it was like. It was a dream. And um, from the time we had our architectural uh, exhibition where we invited architects from all over the island to propose their proposal for what the National Gallery should look like. I walked by the drawing every single day and I never ever thought I'd ever be able to see, actually be standing in it. I wanted it to happen but because I was founding director all my energy was directed towards getting the programs going, the education and trying to get Caymanian artists, local artists too, but mostly Caymanian artists to start appreciating what they did and what they can achieve and um, that, so it, it's pretty amazing. Well, I think what um the, the gallery has done with, with the land that was donated is uh, fantastic. Um, it has been a dream for uh, Helen Harkwell for many years and this started many many years ago. It started as just an idea and a concept and with the help and partners it's come to fruition and today we see the outcome, this beautiful facility, which will be the new home of the uh, art gallery for the Cayman Islands. And I can say that uh, my Aunt Helen is very pleased that she is seeing the, the final outcome after all these years of planning and then the construction and then the development and to finally see the the building get erected and now here we are tonight in this grand opening and uh, she's very pleased about that. Fabulous. Very, very. It's a very happy I'm time. I'm very happy. The heart of, of Helen Harkwell has always been for the people of the Cayman Islands. Uh, it was the same with the, the theatre and it's the same with the gallery and one of the things that she has told me many times I've done this for the people of the Cayman Islands 